Welcome, 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 welcome. Okay. This video is going to be for my college students because I got plenty of you. And I'm so proud of you. I I'm so proud of the young ones. And I'm proud of everybody, okay? But the young ones that take the initiative to change their life through faith or spirituality, no matter what you choose, honestly, when you have something to rely on in, in, in times like that, is is beautiful because yeah you're an adult but you're actually becoming an adult okay as time goes on you're finding your own path you're you're breaking conditioning you're yeah some of you are struggling some of you are not regardless at the end of the day you all struggle with something okay so i'm proud of you guys keep keep working keep studying hard i, I feel like some of you um are having a difficult time um, some of you are having trouble finding what it is you really want to do. Um, I feel like your grades are okay. It's, it's more like, do I switch, do I switch certain curriculums? Do I, do I totally go into another field? It's one of those. Um, take your time with that process. Okay. If, if you're struggling with that, my best suggestion would be to, um, Incorporate maybe other classes in a certain direction you want to go. Not necessarily get out of. Not necessarily get out of. Um, sorry, I, I just I know you guys. Some of you, I just felt that you're feeling alone. But not necessarily get out of that field just yet. Okay, but slowly create something new. Slowly looking to look into other classes. Um, Some of you are are really feeling alone, missing home, but it's more than that. You didn't have that attention at home anyway, and, and it's okay. Don't make court cry, <laughs> okay? You're, you're turning into a young man or a young lady, all right? Um, I got the goosebumps. It, it's time to soar, okay? Um, I got you. I got you guys. Um, no. <sighs> you're okay. You're going to be okay. I promise. Wow. I'm going to touch base with you guys once a week. Okay? Um, wow. You guys are so going to be okay. I can't believe how lonely some of you guys feel. But just think about, like, just think about the beauty. Just think about what you're about to create, what you're going to do with your life, because I can feel it. Your ambition is awesome. I was just going to write it down. I don't need to. I'm not going to forget about you guys. Ugh. Hold on. I'm so sorry. All right, you are so good, okay? What you're going through is just, you are going through an awakening. You're going through a transformation. You're going through everyday life, but your everyday life right now is really chaotic, okay? But it, it's so, it is so all good, all right? Um... What did I just do with that pen? I do want to jot something down. What did I just... Okay, there it is. Um, buy a journal. Okay. Um, if you can't afford a journal. Um, if you can't afford a journal, make one. Get creative. You know, some of you, I feel like you definitely should make one. Okay, it's it's going to help burst your, your creativity. All right. Um... I also want to talk about this after. I want you to get really creative. All right. Um, it, it's your time. You are the next generation. Okay. And maybe that's why I'm feeling the way I'm feeling right now. Because honest to God, you you guys really are our next generation. So thank you. 
thank you for having that much love and thought into what it is you want to do to change certain things because we need that. All right. It, it, it's, it's detrimental. It, it's thank you. Okay. Some of you guys are in China right now studying. Um, but let's, let's just read and see where you guys are at without crying. <laughs> All right. Put a smile on your face. Put a smile on your face. Oh. So hopefully me doing these videos once a week will, will help you out. Okay. You're good. And for those who are not lonely, um, is feeling lost in, in where you're going to go. It all at the end of the day, okay? I, I need you guys. 2019 is is three, okay? It's, it's the number three. It's 12, which is three. In numerology, it's all about creativity, moving forward, pushing yourselves. You know, the art, the way people look at things. It's just, I'm so excited for this year. In a few months from now, we're really going to start seeing drastic changes in technology, landscapes, I mean, you name it. I mean, meet George Jetson, his son, Elroy. I'm pumped, okay? I I'm not talking like cars flying in the air yet, you know? Not quite there, but like, <laughs> you know, I'm ready. So let's see where my college students are. Where you at, everyone? College students all around the world. If you're about to go into college, if you just finished college, this feeds for you. They're not ready. They're not ready. Some of you are partying way too much. Just watch. I know you party. I know people party. Okay, just watch the liquor intake. I'm more or less feeling um, alcohol poisoning. Okay, and I think you tell yourself you just, you wake up the next day or you have a drink to make yourself feel better. Okay, that can become a, an issue. So, and if you're having trouble drinking, it, it's already an issue. Maybe that's where I was feeling the liver thing from. Okay. Um, just be safe, be smart, be smart, okay? Um, let's get you guys an angel message real quick why that does its thing. <sighs> Claritonesis, okay, it, it's notice the guidance that you hear inside your mind or from other people. Okay, it, it's it's that spiritual path I was talking about. You know, gentle, be gentle on yourself. Surround yourself with good friends, people, situations, environments. You, you're vulnerable and, uh, you know, it, it's that whole what I just felt. But be gentle on yourself, meaning if you're giving yourself, you know, overstudying, it's a thing. You know, taking Adderall to stay up, it's a thing. Like, don't, don't do that. It's not necessary. Meditate. Go within. Stop going to La La Land. Don't go to Never Never Land. Okay? Um, gifts from God. Us angels are giving you gifts to create something brand new. Open your arms to receive. This is this is spiritual awareness. This is that awakening. This is... I was going to do a video later on the 5D. This is what this is. Okay? It, it's not like, hey, I'm going to give you a boatload of money. It's not like that. This gift is, is spiritual. It's something that's going to ground you for a lifetime. Okay? Which is, which is absolutely beautiful. Um, and I think that's why, another reason why I got so upset, because I can feel it. Some of you guys are definitely indigo children. All right. Um, you have a bond with children, um, especially those whom are sensitive. So I don't know if, if some of you in early child development, if you're working with certain things, you're, you know, for credits, you're, you're doing something, you're finding a bond with somebody. I, I think one of you are going to end up adopting somebody, to be honest with you. It's clear as day right here on my card. Um, and I got the goosebumps, you know, maybe not now, but when you get out of college, I'm, I'm telling you, you're working, some of you are working with 
an orphanage. And believe it or not, guys, they, they still exist. I, I have one in my town. My town's really richy, and I didn't know for a very long time that we literally have an orphanage, okay? Um, I think they're just called something else these days. But um, it's you'd be surprised. It, they're just not advertised anymore like that, you know? But there is there is a child here that the child you're working with has light hair, light eyes. She adores you. Adores you. All of them do. But this one, man, you got to bond with this one. Even if it takes years for this person, this she could be 17 by the time she comes into your, your household. Or you're just going to be her role model. You will have this connection with this child. Um, I don't know. Some of you feel like you have a past life connection with this child, um, which is possible. I'm not going to really get into it necessarily because that's for a small handful. But that's a thing. Okay. Um, they just told me a, a, a whole big story right there. All right. So let's get back to everyday academics, that type of stuff. College students, find out what's going on. All right, it's conditioning. It's it's breaking through conditioning right now. Some of you are being straight up lazy and not participating. Others are participating. Um, there's that guidance. There's that guidance I was talking about. So you are participating. For those that are straight up lazy, um, this is what this is. Is mommy and daddy are paying tuition? All right, this is one of those Ivy League schools. This is what this is. This is a spoiled child. All right. Um, you're going to have a wake up call. And if you're not, your parents are. And then when that happens, things get taken from you. Okay. This, I'm telling you, this generation's about to get a smackdown. All right. I'm not playing. This world's about to change 20 years from now. You, you wait. It's not for us older generation. We already, we've seen it happen. It's been happening. It's been happening. Okay. It was just 12-12 when I looked, so let's see what that's about. And I was talking about generations, so. Spiritual meaning of 12-12. Okay. Symbolize spiritual growth and an awakening, manifestation of your dreams, the awareness of your infinite being. You should continue to remain positive frame and steer your thoughts in the right direction. All right. Stop being dominant. Have the right type of ambition. Okay, it's a reminder to be aware of your thoughts and, and keeping a positive mind. Let's see the three reasons. You're being guided into a certain certain situation, out of certain relationships, out of certain patterns. And I just spoke about those. Okay. Um, they're going to put you on your right track. Just try to stay positive. All right. And um, manifest. Manifest things. In, instead of being lazy, it, it's almost like you're following in somebody's footsteps or your parents want you to follow in somebody's footsteps and you're just kind of like rebelling. You could just be rebelling right now because you're like, I don't want to be a lawyer. I don't want to be so-and-so. I don't want to take over the family business. I don't want to participate, you know, but you're being guided to honestly do your own thing because you're at your nine. You're like, F that. Okay. So instead of being like, F you, dad, uh, ma, it just, it needs to be approached a different way. Not this way. <laughs> You're in college. Get off your ass. All right. Don't, don't be this person. Uh, I'm going to ace this. I'm going to ace that. I got, I'm paying someone to take my exams to, to X, Y, Z. Don't, don't be that person because that's that smackdown you're about to get because they're they're only steps if you could see this they are only steps away from you the angel is steps away from from busting through that door busting through that college door okay i'm telling you i'm telling you tell me about conditioning So this is you not wanting this particular group right here. This is for you guys not wanting to follow in somebody's footsteps. All right. Looking beyond the illusion, but you're not. It, it's you're looking to go into a new direction. But you, honestly, you don't even know what you want because because of this lazy card. This is a child rebelling. Tell me about laziness. This is I don't want to do this. This is I'm going to go on vacation. I'm going to sit on a beach. I'm going to do this. 
All right. And it was the abundance reverse. It, it, that, see what I'm saying? Look at again. It, it's like that lazy card. All right. You're literally just chilling, but it was reversed. Okay. You're literally just chilling because you have that type of money, but this was reversed. It will be taken from you if you don't stop partaking in something you want to do. I'm, I'm not kidding. Okay. Court is warning you. Tell me about participation. This is you having to participate. This is you just kind of like, eh, you know, it, it's a brand new experience. And you're like, eh, I, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna sit here. I, I mean, it, it's really bothering me, but I, I need to stress it to you. Okay. Um, that came flying out. Guess who that is? Guess who that is? The rebel. Okay. This is what I'm saying. Instead of you partaking, you're just, you're rebelling. Okay. You should have did it as a teenager. <laughs> um, get, get, get together. Okay. Get, get off of this. Tell me about guidance. Cause this is, this is coming. All right. It's one of those things where it's just, it's, it's coming and yeah, it's something will be taken. All right. It's, they're gonna, it will be in their control. Okay, because you must have a very special gift. You're very, um, you want to know why you're so zen-like? Because it's like you're spiritual. You have gifts. You have things to offer. Okay, and you're just kind of like, eh, all right. Or it's, I'm going to follow in somebody's footsteps and I got nothing to worry about because all my parents have to do is sign something. All the dean has to do is sign something. You know, it's just like, don't be foolish because... That was for a group. I'm going to read for one more, but that was for a group that you're going to get caught up if you continue to do that. Okay, so stop. Stop being that person. Okay, let's see if I can get one more group. And that was a warning. All right, chances are you're probably not watching me, that group. <laughs> you're just kind of like, and if you're watching, you're watching for like shits and giggles, all right? But you keep watching. You watch the transformation. You keep watching. I dare you. All right, college students, another group of college students. And like I said, the first group, you, you're doing great. You're working early childhood development. There's something there for sure. Um, but just be gentle. Just be gentle on yourself, okay? You have a completion. You have creativity. This is going through, working through the puzzle. This is, you know, this is the miser. It's, it's that bitchy attitude. It's that... I don't know if it's a teacher, if it's a professor, it, it, regardless, you're not having it, all right? You're letting your creativity lead the way. You, you completed something, you're, you're about to, or you're about to complete something, but to me, this is, this is you. Here's that creativity I was talking about, okay? Um, I, I think you're close to completing something. For some, it's just, it's an essay, okay? And you got to hand it in to somebody who's miserable, and you're just kind of like, eh, but don't worry about it. All right, somebody might be like, whoa. You might be surprised because you might set, hand something in and it, it's so extreme. It, it's so out of the box. It, it's a spiritual thing. It, it's your thoughts. It's your creativity. And you're probably going to be like, this person's going to be like, this has nothing to do with anything. You, you're going to be surprised by this person, this professor. This is what this is. Tell me about this professor. You're going to be surprised. I, I'm telling you, I got the goosebumps. You're so worried about handing something in. You know, tell me about this professor. All right, we got understanding. See, the, the I'm not quite sure what that's telling me, but they're going to get it. I want this one too. Yeah, see, possibilities. There's something here. I'm not sure what this is, but they're, they're going to get it. Look at two birds right next to each other. I don't know what that's all about. To me, you're going to soar. They're going to understand. I don't know what this is. But anything that has to do with creativity and you being so close to completing it, but being worried to pass it in, don't. This professor is going to get it and you're going to be shocked. You're going to be shocked. Okay. That's beautiful. All right. Let's see what else we can get. Any other messages? Any other messages? Any other messages? I'm kind of feeling health, but it, it's more or less, I think it's back to like the drinking or whatever. Somebody is thinking about going into politics. Well, you don't want to go into politics, okay, is, is what's happening. 
you're going to have a breakthrough when it comes to something. The the politics, it was reversed. You don't you don't want it. You want nothing to do with politics. There's not that great money. There's not great money in politics, okay? Maybe if you come from a wealthy family, all right, you you weasel your way in somehow. I mean, if you want to go in a different direction. So if you're thinking about politics but taking it like like happy medium, so you have that happy medium, but I don't know if there can ever be that happy medium. Everyone's entitled for their opinion, okay? I, I'm I can talk about politics all day. I, I that I try to stay stuff far away from that. Okay. Um, I don't think you want anything to do with it. Or what I think you're doing is you're trying to create something brand new, uh, a, a new a new outlook on something. I mean, we've had people that have tried that throughout the years and years and years and years. I mean it's it's great. All right. If you want to try it, go ahead. Because there's a breakthrough right here. It's going to be hard work, okay? It's... Oh, that's too many. But try. Okay? To me, I, I feel like, to me, abundance and celebration... <sighs> this is something... This is something good, okay? This breakthrough, whatever this is. Someone's pulling away from politics. Anything... Um, I'm not quite sure. I just... You're pulling away, which is great. There's a breakthrough. It has to do with money, celebration, something that makes you happy. It's clear as day. Um, what does tell me about this celebration? I mean, it could be a political party. It could be some type of event. But I don't think you want to go. But if you do go, I, I think you're going to present something that's going to rattle some people. Look at that. I just said it. It's going to be intense. All right. I called it. I called it. You're about to open some eyes. Awareness. You're about to open some eyes here. It's a different approach on politics. It's not the traditional conditioning. It's not the traditional politic type thing. It's, it's a new breakthrough. It's going to be intense. I'm excited. I'm excited. Hit me up. <laughs> Hit me up. I don't even think you're watching like you're not even, like, in between, like, CNN, Fox, none of that. You're, you're just, like, you're doing your thing. That's awesome. Okay. Um, let me see if I can briefly get something on you guys in a relationship. I mean, I know that's not what's key here, but I know some of you are guys are obviously in a relationship, and I am a love channel, all right? But I think the bigger, the bigger picture was everything else that I just got a grasp on, okay? I just gotta text my daughter back real quick. I don't wanna pause you. So bottom line, even with that whole politics thing too, I I think that's great because you're looking you're looking at something differently. You're about to it it I think it's gonna blow up whatever that is within due time, believe it or not, because it's your approach, it's the intensity, it's it's the attitude, it's the I don't know. You got that though. That's about to go somewhere for damn sure. And now my mouth's calling. <laughs> it must just got real chaotic for you guys. For real disease. All right. So, love a situation for college students. Ooh, you're yeah, someone's motivation. Ooh, wee. Ooh, wee. Yeah, you're loving this situation. There we go. Celebration. I, I knew I felt it. You're coming out of this hangman mode. You're, someone, you're not talking to somebody, but here's the thing you're using, you're looking beyond your years and as i just said that here comes the master i don't know what that's all about wow you you college students that i got the goosebumps you guys are freaking smart you're way smarter than we were holy shit i can already see the difference in the generation i'm so happy 
Because it's funny, as soon as I said you're looking beyond something, here comes the master. Like, obviously, but it, I, this enough says you're looking beyond. But the fact that the, your ascendant masters are, are pushing through, I mean, this is, this is your ascendant masters. I mean, you're pretty gifted. You got the masters working with you. I bet you you see master numbers a lot. Um. And you don't necessarily, just because the master, ascendant masters are working with you, doesn't necessarily mean you have to see master numbers. But I guarantee in your life path, you have you have probably at least two or three master numbers. And, and that's a lot in a life path, okay? I don't know if this is a third party. Because I feel like you're hung up on something. Or your girlfriend or your boyfriend just partying too much and it's getting the best of you. It could be that. You know what I'm saying? Something's getting the best of you here when it comes to whomever your lover is right now. Tell me about this three. But you're being guided to to kind of leave the situation. All right? And it was reversed. You're, you're, it's going with the flow, but I want this card too on top. I don't know what it is. I, I really don't feel like you're going with the flow, though. I kind of feel like you're drowning a little bit. Look at it. It's like, I just want to feel you in harmonies reversed. Look at all that water. I just want to feel your hands all over me, baby. Like, I, I think you're, like, definitely dreaming about somebody. You want somebody back. There's somebody that probably just wants to date and have fun in college. And I think you got some strong, strong feelings for this person. But you're just kind of trying to go with the flow because there's something about this person. And I believe you're right. Okay? Um... I don't know. You might kind of be losing your mind a little bit, but like this person calms you. There's something here, but don't, I don't want you to read into it. I, I want you to study. I want you to worry about your studies. Let this person go with the flow for a little while. Try to go with the flow. Let this person do their thing. Have safe sex, you know, um, let something naturally happen here. Okay. How about we, we step into that with this generation where we let things happen and unfold the way they're supposed to? That would be a great thing if I can teach that because that's, that's how chances are it probably won't happen, all right? To, to break everybody like that, we come in programs, all right? But you guys could have come in programs differently. So let this happen naturally. It's driving you nuts, though. There is something there, though. You're right. I'm not going to lie. And it's almost like I don't even want to tell you that because I don't want you to be pulled. Okay? So don't do that to yourself, please. Worry about you. Don't don't be a chaser. Don't. They make you happy. So when you spend time together, if this is your person, trust me, you're going to make them feel the same way. And they're going to want to start stop dating. They'll, they'll pursue you more. All right? It's not even play hard to get. You can still open up. You have a little bit of fear of... You can... Wow. You can feel this person. Here's the deal. When After you guys make love, are you just cuddling? Okay. Um, I feel like you guys don't cuddle much like that. But I don't know why that came to me. But I, I feel like you went to go grab someone's hand. Or they're playing with your hand, right? And... It's like you want to say to this person, like, I got you. I'm right here. But you're fearing it. I don't think you want to go that deep because you know there's something here. And I think you think it freaks them out. I guess my best advice I can give you right now is go with the flow. But be honest with yourself, too, okay? Because you're not really happy. So best advice for this situation. Because I, I think this person likes to date and just have fun and, and, and does their studies. I don't see anything bad. I just, you just know, okay? Don't let it consume you because right now you're kind of letting it consume you, okay? So you will eventually have this breakthrough. It's funny. Some of these same cards are coming out. I'm telling it a different story, all right? And this politics right here is somebody's wearing a mask. All right. Somebody just wants to play. So they know who you are, too. 
see see I knew I knew I could feel it I, I could feel something but I'm telling you right now you gotta go with the flow this politics card right now straight up someone's wearing a mask they just want to play okay they just want to have fun right now right now like I said okay um, but there will be a breakthrough eventually okay I wouldn't I wouldn't like don't compare yourself to other people don't be doing any of that. Tell me about this breakthrough. Tell me about this breakthrough. This is in due time, all right? Yeah, so you're clinging on to the past, and it's something. It doesn't even have to do with this person. I don't think they cheated. I mean, it's a possibility, but, like, what this is telling me, it's reversed, so you're no longer doing it. Could they have cheated and you took them back? Mm, possibly, but if that's the case, I don't think this person will come back around in your life for years because this person's got a lot to learn. If this person has not cheated and it's just somebody you're dating and going with the flow, there's most something definitely there. In either scenario, there is, but this it's going to take this person a long time if this person cheated. You, you're best just getting out of the situation. I'm not going to lie to you. It will come back in due time. For those who did not cheat and you know you feel something with this person and you know it's, it's, it's something you just know and there's no cheating, could they be dating? And yeah, you know, but like... That's a different scenario. There's something there. Go with the flow on that one. For the other ones who's cheated in the past, uh, they're, I don't think they're doing so great right now. I think they're still, they're still wearing a mask. They're, and you're not happy. Cut the ties, please. Cut the ties and save yourself some pain. Start looking at things in different perspectives. Because in our reality, this, this last group right here, this is for no matter what group. This is getting creative, going forward, looking beyond the illusion, knowing that you know it's no good. All right, following a different path, listening to that inner voice, going through ascensions, going through things, transformations, transmutations, awareness, all that stuff, okay? Tell me about the master. So you guys, focus on, focus on you. All right, yeah, see, letting go, because it took me back to that. Let go of this person who's cheating. Let go of this person that's doing that. And even if the person has not cheated before, and we're back to the first scenario, just let it go. You know there's something. If you can't go with the flow, then let it go right now. Because what's meant to be will be. And it will come back around because there is something here. So we got a group where it gets tricky because we got one group definitely cheated. Okay. Let it go. That one's no good. Even if they come back, it won't be for a couple years. This person's going to play. For the other ones who it's just they don't want a commitment because they are dating and playing, but you know there's something more and you're afraid to speak, then, you know, if you can't open up, then just let it go for a little while. If you, if it, But I feel like this person makes you happy when you're together. I just don't want this person consuming you. Because there's something here. And it's, yeah, it's with this person. But at the same time, I feel like you should be paying way more attention to creating you, working on you, creating a, a future for you. Anything else? Okay. Yeah, see? It's just, it's a blank slate. Okay, create something brand new for you. Okay. Um it's it's you're you're an antenna right now. Okay. Take this opportunity with this blank slate. You know, it's it's a void, yeah, but to me it's always a blank slate. It's this opportunity to create something new and I'm telling you like it's it has to do with spirituality or or, or just your purpose, your your life path, but they're giving you a new opportunity, whether you work with religion, or, it doesn't matter. It's just, you don't have to do spiritual work necessarily. I mean, you could work with children, you, anything that benefits anything and you're happy doing it is something that you can create, something brand new. You know, who says, you know, you got to go by the standards? Who says you got to be this? Who says you got to be that? Go create a new career for a whole new generation to follow. Okay. So, I love you guys. Um, I will be back next week for you guys. All right. I got the goosebumps. I got you. I got you guys.
Okay. I'm going to pull you one angel card for the week. College students, one angel card for the week. For the week. Guidance for the week. Something flipped. I'm not sure I already flipped them. All right, but I'm going to pull one more. It was the king of water. I'm not I'm not really sure, okay? But it's it's being trustworthy, being compassionate, being respectful, okay? Um, looking into culture, you know, seeing something. It says, open your heart and mind to those around you, but only those who are trustworthy and heartfelt, okay? So it's that clarity work. It's it's creating what you want and letting go of what no longer serves you too, okay? We kind of just talked about that. I, I wanted to add it in. But we got the six of earth. This is gifts. This is money. This is effort. This is new opportunities in college. Um, like I said, new career paths too. Choosing like a new subject, going in a new direction. Um, receiving loans and paying off debts. Okay. So, you know, student loans, which is great. Maybe you'll get a chunk of money somehow. You, you never know. All right. But just be smart about it because this is a gift. There's something coming at you. Okay. It's gifts of money time, effort. You're going to say you're writing an essay or you spent a lot of time on this new project. You, you, you're going to see the effort. You're going to get rewarded for that time. It could just be public recognition or it could be money. Okay. It, and some of you are waiting about that money. Okay. The loans, we talked about that or I felt that. I don't know if I really discussed it, but you're going to receive that loan. And that is, and I got the goosebumps, so some of you most definitely are, and that, that is great news. It, it could even be for next semester, and you were worried. You were all, like, I just felt the word, like, you were like, I'm more than worried, Court, I was tripping, you know, but now now you know you're going to be golden for next year or next semester. Maybe it's the books you needed, I'm not quite sure, but what a beautiful card for somebody who is in college. It's a gift, okay? So, I love, I love you guys so much. Talk soon. Bye.